on April 3rd, I placed an order at Amazon. I bought this giant bottle of black pepper. You can get this kind of black pepper here, but it's hit or miss on finding it. I've been here 14 months and I've found one little container of black pepper and I haven't been able to find any since then. So I bought this at Amazon. At the same time, I placed an order for this little device here, this trivet for my free $185 instant pot. And I bought this lid for my free $185 instant pot. This video isn't about these particular items. This video is about how I got these here, how much it cost me, and how long it took. And when I come back, I'm gonna give you all the details. Hey! Oh, rocket cheek. Hello there. Okay, so here we go. I well, This is my spreadsheet that I put together for the purposes of this video. As you can see, I broke down every little detail as much as I could. I placed the order on the July the 3rd, which is right here. Order placed at Amazon. The order was only $35.61. On the 9th, the order arrived at myus.com in Sarasota. So that's my new US shipping address. Okay, and then on the 9th also, myus.com placed a, a value or an assessment on the order as this, this is the estimated value for purposes of determining the import fees assessed by Ecuador, okay? And then on the 10th, they shipped, okay? They shipped my US ship MyUS.com shipped the order via FedEx budget economy. Okay, and uh, this was shipped now on its way to my address here in Monta. On the 10th also, they charged me $42.61 for shipping. So that was the shipping fee, okay, which I think is not bad, based on three pounds. And on the 11th, I received a notice from FedEx that the item was on the way. And then on the 14th, I received a call from FedEx to get my cedula, as you can see here. And then on the 18th, I had to pay $12.35 via a deposit to Banco Pacifico. Now, let me say something about that right quick. The, um, I, I, I don't check my spam folder as much as I should. Uh, this, this notice had been sitting probably in my spam folder for two or three days. Uh, so that kind of extended the time that it took to get the order here because I wasn't checking my spam folder. So if you deal with myus.com for shipping stuff here, um, be sure to keep tabs on your spam folder in your email program. I don't know why this particular email went into the spam folder, but it did. So I went like three days without knowing that I had this notice to go pay this fee. And this 1235 is the customs import fee that was assessed. Apparently my US does not, they don't charge you an estimated fee for import fees like Amazon does. So keep that in mind, okay? Then on the 19th, I received here, I received email notification that the package will be delivered today, uh, that day on the 19th, which it didn't. And then on the 22nd, I received a text from a FedEx delivery guy here in Monta that my package will be delivered today, which this was yesterday. And sure enough, it was delivered. It was delivered about seven o'clock last night. So it took from the 3rd to the 22nd, about two and a half weeks here, count a seven day week, about two, almost three weeks, two and three quarter weeks to get from Amazon to my address here in Monta via FedEx economy, FedEx budget economy. Now, 
when you sign up for myus.com, you get you get several choices that you can choose from for shipping. Okay. Um, if I still have it pulled up here, I'll show you. Um, here it is. If you go, this is myus.com. This is my my page here. If I, I can go here over here on the right hand side and see how to estimate how estimated shipping. Well, somewhere in here, there is a way to see what it would cost you to get something shipped. And this is it, get shipping rates. So from my US address, delivered to Ecuador, and let's say three pounds, okay, get my rates. So here's the choices you get. My US Swift Saver, one to four days. And by the way, you kind of establish what shipping method you want to use when you set up your account here and then they will just do that by default every time you ship something uh, so one to four days three pounds would cost you 27.69 you see there's some limitations and then another option is budget economy five to ten days for us 39.62 or dhl express us 41.99 for one to four days delivery and of course you can see these are all conditions that apply. Here is US $50.96, two to five days to every FedEx economy. All right. And then here's US $56.75, one to three days for FedEx priority. I don't know which one of these I use. I guess FedEx economy. Still, it was less than these. It was DHL Express. That's who I thought I was using. But back to my spreadsheet. You can see I use FedEx Budget Economy. They're only charging 4261, so I don't know why, why the difference. So that's pretty much it. If you look at the breakdown here, here was the purchase price at Amazon 3561, and then the shipping by myus.com was 4261. The customs fee was 1235. So that's a total of 90 dollars and 57 cents that I had to pay to get a. $35 package delivered here and it took 19 days. So that's it folks. That's what it costs. or have rang the bell and uh, crap I'm talking about the price of beer uh, well shit never gonna get this shit right I'm, damn it for the living in Costa Rica I mean uh, Panama Ecuador uh, eventually I'm gonna figure out where the hell I am